Hey everybody, this is Travis and I'm bringing today's story time. So I'm a big fan of the band Switchfoot. And when they were recording their album, Oh Gravity, several years back, they started doing a video podcast, just kind of like a vlog. And they'd upload episodes every once in a while. And in one of the early episodes, there's a clip of several of the members in a conference room with a British guy with spiky hair and long sideburns. And I didn't know who he was. I knew he wasn't part of the band, but I didn't know what he was doing there. I just always remembered his face and he was shown a couple more times in later episodes. Flash forward to a couple years ago, I'm going to school at the Recording Conservatory of Austin uh, for audio engineering. And my teacher, Brad, who was my recording techniques teacher, always mentioned this guy named Tim Palmer. So he was an award-winning producer and works with U2 and Ozzy Osbourne. He did one of the Rush albums. Big deal. And one night I'm at a student seminar, standing in the office, and that guy from the podcast walks in and walks right by me. And I immediately recognized who he was. And I went up to my teacher, Brad, and I was like, this guy right here, he was, I saw him in a Switchfoot podcast. And he goes, yeah, that's Tim Palmer. And I kind of freaked out for a minute. I was like, wow, small world. Well, one of the other things I had to do was in my Pro Tools class, we helped build some diffusers for a studio downtown. I learned how to build them and stuff, and we kind of set up the diffusion and the bass traps in the studio. So that was really cool. Flash forward a couple months later, I'm with my advanced Pro Tools teacher, Travis, who you may have seen me interview for the Drum Chats website. And Travis told me that he works for Tim Palmer. He's his assistant producer, assistant engineer. And one day I'm meeting Travis at that same building that we built the studio for. Um, There's like a hallway of different studios. And Tim is in there and Travis is like, oh, let let me introduce you. I got to meet Tim, really nice guy. Told him I love the, the album, that whole thing. Well, then Travis and I, go into the studio and I realized that it was Tim's studio that he was mixing in that I had built the bass traps and diffusers for. Crazy collaboration of different times. But that's my story of meeting Tim Palmer. Really nice guy, super cool British accent, and lives in Austin, Texas. So if you're in Austin and you come across Tim, you should go say hi and go check out my interview with Travis. Let's get back to the show. Hey guys, uh, welcome back to the show. 